Hey guys, Kel here, bringing you another video. This one is going to be uh, what I think is probably be the laziest way to farm at your Builder Hall 9 level. And it works even at the higher levels of Town Hall. Because I believe the only uh, defense you get is the Expo. I don't think you get anything else. So, uh, something I've noticed, I'm going to be using Mass Minion is that a lot of bases don't have, like just there isn't much splash when it comes to uh, defending yourself against the air. And a lot of bases have like a roaster on the outside where you can easily tank with your hero. So I think as long as you're tanking with your hero, you can just kind of spam minions into the base and their DPS is really high and the only thing that can really stop them are archer towers and air defenses uh and of course the air bombs but even the big air bombs they like attack slow enough that you, you can get lucky and it will kind of just chip out the 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 bombs and they don't do a lot of damage to you so you can kind of just use the minion and uh, spam your like minions into the base and kind of roll it it's not going to give you six stars per se, but if you're looking for a way to just kind of throw troops at a base and close your game, um, you might be able to get a lot of three stars, especially on lower developed bases. And uh, no, I haven't really seen anyone talking about it because everyone wants to talk about their six star strategies, but six starring gets you a lot of gold and all that. But for the most part, you can just kind of come here and take these. Uh, easy two stars and when it comes to the next base every base is different um, but usually you can find some sort of way to uh, take out the rest of the base here so I've what I see here is I can probably just use the cannons here I'm gonna take out these, uh, these CC troops I think I'm just gonna try and take those out because this is what's going to stop my cannon carts here and I'll just drop two right here to kind of take this archer tower out and it looks like nothing can really stop these cannon carts here uh, from taking out the builder hall here and I'm going to get a pretty easy four star here. Uh, I have another, I have a replay that I can show. Uh, that I'll show really quick. But yeah, it's just four stars, really simple. Um, and here's another one. I failed a few before this, but um, but here, even with the air bomb, I just was like, let's just throw it in here. I was thinking that I would bring a flex spot for the fifth, or one, two, three, four, five, for the sixth slot. But yeah, but look at this. It takes out like, one it took out one minion you know the air bomb it just travels and here i even messed up the tanking and just it you just go it just goes and it easily three stars and like this gets taken out we go to the next stage and it's just on the outside you get the fourth star free so i do have a lot of faith in this of course if you want to get really good at the game and do all that uh this probably isn't the best strategy because you're not really learning anything. You're just kind of spamming. But if you're like me and you just want to find the most efficient way to just get your stuff done, get your goals finished, and uh, that's just kind of the main purpose of it. So here you can get blown out. So here I got blown out by the bomb and uh, that's just going to happen sometimes. But here we're tanking. Uh, we're not going to get much done here because we got so blown out that much, but it will happen, you know. This attack isn't going to work every single time, and that's why you saw my attack earlier that had zero stars. Um, and it's just if that happens, you're going to get blown out. Um, and if you get blown out, you're going to find a weaker bases, you know. So I'll do one more. Hopefully we find something that's good. So here we have no roaster, and this is actually a higher upgraded thing. Uh... Here I would use the balloon. Is it worth using balloon? Well, this is, let's just see. 
uh, how it goes. Uh, because this one feels like I could just send in a balloon to tank for all this, but for the sake of the video, let's just see how it goes. And, oh yeah, because see, we outranged the air bombs. It didn't even get a hit off. So, it's just, it's, it's, we're going to come in here and we're going to see what we get. The only thing defending are, of course, these archer towers and some hidden Tesla. But we get our hero up here. We're going to take this out over here. And yeah, it's a wrap, you know? And even though we're losing all our minions here, it doesn't really matter uh, how you get the 3-star, how much troops you have left after the 3-star. All that really matters is that the 3-star happens. And I don't think people are respecting minions um, in the way that they probably should. And I feel that it's a lot more easy uh, and stress-free than uh, P.E.K.K.A. raids, where people are starting to develop their bases to kind of have these islands to kind of funnel the P.E.K.K.A.s to go where they want the P.E.K.K.A.s to go. And no one can really funnel air troops, you know, the especially ones that target anything. They're just going to go in a straight line and wipe it out. Very similar to Electro Dragons, um, in the sense. And uh, they kind of just go to the core, you'll get the two star. I think people have tried this with the Baby Dragon. Um, and the Baby Dragon, of course, works, but it doesn't get to the core. It kind of kills everything on the outside. So it will either three star or one star. And even though this one can zero star if you get blown out, uh, I don't think you're getting blown out enough for it to matter and the double cannon cart really is really strong here but like this roaster is not being used and the airs if you if you have enough afterwards you can really uh take a lot of advantage here but i'm gonna just go do the double cannons here um and hopefully we can take out this cannon oh no come on take that out then we'll take this out here and we'll just do this and it's a wrap you know we're even probably going to get the 50 percent here so uh double cannon cart of course really strong uh you can get a lot of value with one but when it comes to time and we're just trying to get the 50 percent uh it's uh the time doesn't really matter here so oh Let's go over here. That should be enough, right? Okay, we're... Oh, the test popped up. Are we too close? Doom. Doom. Nice. Uh, but yeah, even 70%. So the, the double cannon car at the end is really strong. So I just wanted to make a quick video about Mass Minion and how it's just, I think, very... It's oddly strong. Especially that outranges the the bombs here. And uh, I'm not sure if it outranges the roaster. Let's see, the roaster has a... Does it say the tile range? Uh, range, 7 tiles. And here, 7.5 tiles. So it can outrange both the roaster and the giant bomb. So you can kind of go straight into it. Uh, that's actually good to know. So maybe this attack strategy is really strong. Uh, or much stronger. But... Definitely very strong for the amount of thought that goes into it. And if you're lazy and you just want to spam one troop and get good results, I think you should at least give the minions a go. So, hope you all enjoyed the video. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.